Meanwhile, in New Jersey, cases are rising in Camden County. That's where a new drive-up COVID-19 testing site opened today. Our Alicia Reed joining us now from Cherry Hill with more. Alicia. Good afternoon, Janelle. O officials say the second wave is here, and the number of cases here in New Jersey is outrageous. They're spiking in Camden County, and it is concerning. With the current infection rates higher than they were earlier in the pandemic, there's now an increased demand for testing. The Department of Health, Camden County Freeholder Board, and Cooper University Healthcare teamed up to offer this free drive-through testing site at the Camden County College Cherry Hill campus. Now it's available to county residents by appointment pending certain criteria. Health officials say there were a thousand new cases last week and they're expecting to break that record by the end of this week. So the, while they understand that some residents are starting to experience COVID fatigue, they reiterate now is the time to buckle up and practice common sense precautions such as washing your hands regularly, sanitizing and wearing a face mask, and also social distancing. With the holidays right around the corner, health experts suggest staying away from large gatherings, particularly in poorly ventilated areas. I would recommend you keep the gatherings small. I would not have large gatherings of extended family, especially if they're coming from different areas. Keep it small, less than 10 people, Okay, preferably if you can do it outside, if you can gather outside, do so. You can also take the extra step of getting tested a few days before your holiday get together. Now this testing site will be open during the week, Monday through Friday from 9.30 to 4.30 and on the weekends from 8.30 in the morning until 11.30. Reporting live from Cherry Hill, New Jersey, Alicia Reed. CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Back to you, Janelle. All right, Alicia, thanks so much. And stay with Eyewitness News for the latest on the COVID-19 pandemic. And when you're not near a TV, you can head over to cbsphilly.com or our streaming service, CBSN Philly.